the farmers are generally doing it pretty tough and we're working to provide assistance for farmers and help them recover from the flood event that's happened last year. This year is a little bit difficult because of the effect of floods. When we started to get out and have a bit of a look around when the waters receded, uh, we've got channels that need to be reinstated, a fair bit of fencing on farm that needs to be put back together. It's put the brakes on, cash flow's pretty well shot. The flood has impacted mainly on the, the fences around the properties and, and with the amount of works required, the local contractors just can't keep up with it. So rural aid volunteers are here doing uh, predominantly fencing. They're doing tough uh, with floods and whatnot and they just need some show of love and support. Uh, having, having some rural aid volunteers here to clear some of the debris off the fencing and, and, and straighten that fence up will be a, a huge difference for us. You meet the farmers, they're a bit uh, down, and then uh, uh, by the end of the week they're chatting, they've got a little bit of a gleam in their eye. It plays with your mind when you've got so much, so much to do. It, it really does affect your mental health. Just the peace of mind knowing that that's one less thing that I have to take care of. It's a wonderful initiative and the people involved should be congratulated.